Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. I hope you are doing well. So in this video we will learn about how we can customize the related list in Salesforce. So in this topic we will deep dive into what is related list in Salesforce, what is the purpose of related list, what are the different uses of it. After that we will see use case and according to that I will explain you how we can customize the related list in Salesforce. So for that watch the video till the end and don't miss any step. After that you can also able to customize the related list in Salesforce. And if you are new to our channel hit the subscribe button and press the bell icon. So whenever we post any new video you will get an update. Now before moving ahead here is very big announcement for the Salesforce geekers who wants to start journey in the Salesforce. If you are looking to start your journey in Salesforce but you don't know where to begin. Don't worry we are here to help you. So we have created 50 plus hours Salesforce course designed specially for the beginners and no prior experience needed. We explain every concept in a simple and easy to understand way. So you can learn step by step with the confidence. So this course is for beginner to the advanced level. In that we have covered 10 modules you will get lifetime access. After that we also have provided course material and you will get the certification after the completion. So here you can see here we have covered 10 modules introduction to Salesforce, Salesforce navigation and setup. After that Salesforce user management. Then we also have covered Salesforce apps, object and tabs. After that the Salesforce fields and formulas, UI customization in Salesforce. After that Salesforce reports and dashboards, Salesforce data management and Salesforce flows. So in this course we have covered everything from beginner to the advanced level. And this isn't just a theory. You will get hands on project and real world examples and practical exercise to help you apply what you learn. So if you are serious about launching your Salesforce career, check out the course now. We have provided the link in the description box. You can go through it. Now let's jump to the topic. Now first let's understand what is the related list in Salesforce. So the related list provide a way to display the related records on the objects record page. That means if any object in the relationship that will be lookup, master detail or many to many relationship. If any object in the relationship then the related records we can display on the parent record. After that the related list helps users quickly access and manage the related data without navigating to the different records manually. So for example accounts and contacts are in the lookup relationship. And now if you want to create the contact record from the account object then we can navigate to the related list and from there we can create the contact record without navigating to the contact object. Then the related list are commonly used in the standard and custom objects to show the child records associated activities and related relationships. So here also we can say that in the account and contact object we can see the related contacts of that particular account on the account object. Now let's understand the different uses of related list in Salesforce. So the related list display the related data. That means it shows the records that are linked to the relational objects. So first let's understand this one. For that here I am navigating to the Salesforce org. Now here I am opening the account object. As I open any account record and after that as you scroll down here you can see here we have contact object, opportunity object and then case object. So in the related list we can see the related records to this account object. So here we have one contact object to relate this Burlington Textile Corporation of America. Then also we have one opportunity record and then there are two cases with related of this particular account record. After that second use we have quick actions that means users can create edit and delete related records directly from the related list. Let's understand this one. So for example here you can see here we have one contact record with related to this particular account record. Now as I click on this drop down here you can see here we have three options edit, delete and then add to campaign. And also here you can see here we have new button using that we can create the new contact to relate this particular account record. So currently here you can see here we only have one contact record. As I click on this new button now here. I am creating new contact record. In the first name here I am providing Joy. In the last name here I am providing Lobo. Scroll down and here you can see in the account name the Burlington Textile Corporation of America account has been by default added. Here I am providing lead source. 
which is web and then simply click on save. Now here you can see the joy logo contact has been successfully created to related this account record. Now as you navigate to the contact object here also you can see that the contact record will be created. So here I am changing the list view. Here you can see the joy logo has been successfully created to related to Burlington Textile Corporation of America account. Now we can also edit the record for that again navigate to the account open the account record again. Now here I want to add the title for that as you click on this drop down click on edit search for the title. Now here I am providing related list as you click on save here you can see the related list title has been successfully added again as you navigate to the contacts open the contact click on details as you scroll down search for the title so here you can see in the title field here we have related list has been successfully added and this one we have updated without navigating to the contact object so this is the use of related list in the salesforce now let's again see the another use so here we also have the customization option that means the admin can customize which field appear in the related list again navigate to the salesforce org click on accounts open the account record and currently here you can see in the contact record here we have title email and phone now i want to display the another fields in the related list for that what we can do click on this gear icon click on setup click on object manager now we need to navigate to the object on which we want to customize the related list so here we want to customize the account related list so here i am opening the account object here you can see page layout click on it after that i also have the created video on the page layout in salesforce the video link i have given in description box you can go through it in that i have detail explained the page layout in salesforce so that you can easily understand what are the page layouts and what are the uses of page layout in salesforce so here first we need to check which page layout we are using so for that i opened the page layout assignment as i scroll down here i am using the system administrator profile and the page layout we have assigned which is account layout again go back and now we are going to customize the account layout click on it now here you can see here we have fields button custom links quick actions so here we also have the related list option click on it and now here you can see here we have contacts opportunity cases and then open activities also so first we will see how we can add the different fields in the contact object for that click on this icon and now from here we can select the fields that we want to display on the related list for particular contact object. So here I am removing the email, title and phone also. If you want to select multiple fields click on the control and after that select the fields and here I am clicking on remove. After that here I want to add the facts. Click on add. Again we also have the lead source. Here I am searching for the lead source. Here I am adding the lead source also and you can add fields that you want to add so here I am clicking on and then as you scroll down here we also have the filter to sort the fields here we have ascending and descending order and after that here you can see apply column information to other page layouts that means here we are using the account layout and if you want to change the for different page layout also you can change from here also now to save this I need to minimize this one and here you can see now we have option to save for that here I am clicking on ok and then simply click on save. Now again as I navigate to the account record let me refresh this one. So before refreshing here you can see here we have title email and phone number as I refresh this one this time here you can see here we have facts and then lead source. So in this way we can customize the fields in the related list in salesforce. Now I want to display the opportunities before the contact for that again navigate to the page layout open the account layout there that we are using again navigate to the related list and now here you can see here we have opportunities drag this and drop to the before account. So here I am dropping to the before account 
here you can see opportunities and then contacts click on save again click on yes again navigate to the account record refresh the page and now here you can see we have opportunities before the accounts now in the related list we have opportunities contacts cases and then notes and attachment now here i want to and also we have the partners now i want to add the approval history in the related list of this account object for that again navigate to the account page layout so here i am opening the account layout click on related list and here you can see here we have approval history from here you can select anything to add to the related list so here i am adding the approval history for that drag this and drop where you want so here in the related list i want to drop to the before the opportunities so here i am dropping there and then click on save again click on yes again navigate to the object and before refreshing here you can see here we also have here we only have the opportunities as i refresh the page now we also have the approval history before the opportunities now why we can see the opportunities contacts and cases record over here because these records are in the relationship with the account object and if you want to see the related records to the particular object that object will be parent object that means these all the object opportunity contacts and cases these all objects are the child object now in this case account is a parent object of these three objects now let's see the another use of this related list for that navigate to the ppt lightning and classic support the related list are available in both ui versions but have enhanced feature in lightning experience so here you can see now before enabling the enhanced related list here you can see the default related list look like this let me zoom out and now we will enable the enhanced related list for that here you can see click on this gear icon again let me zoom in and now here we need to navigate record page for that here you can see here we have edit page option click on it here you can see the account record page has been open now here we need to select the related list for that click on this related list and now here you can see related list type as you click on it here we have option enhance list select this one to enhance the related list and then click on save click on activate then click on close again click on save and then again navigate to the related list so it's not activated again let me navigate to the record page for that click on edit page it's still not activated here you can see related list type is default only select the enhanced list click on save and now activate this page to make it visible to your users so here i am clicking on activate so in the org default here i am clicking on assign as org default and then click on next after that click on save now again here i am clicking on save and then again go back to the related list as i scroll down and this time here you can see after enabling the enhanced related list the opportunities contacts then cases before it was displaying without column and now after enabling the enhanced list here you can see it is displaying in the column so these are the uses of related list in the salesforce where we can see the related record of particular object i hope whatever i explain you understood that if you like the video hit the like button subscribe our channel and press the bell icon so that whenever we post in any video you will get an update thank you